Hi, I'm Mason, and today in 60 Second Science, we're going to be learning about robots. Robots are machines that are autonomous. That means they move by themselves. This one even talks. Stop interrupting me. You can enter commands on the central processing unit or the brain of the robot. Robots use sensors like they use our five senses. This ultrasonic sensor detects objects so the robot knows when to stop. This is not a robot. Robots are by themselves. I'm using remote control. Other robots can be programmed on tablets or computers to follow a series of commands or steps. But robots can only do what you tell them to do. That's it for 60 Second Science. I'm going to go program this robot. Have a heart. Help a pet. Every year at Loft Oaks, we help pets with our community service project. These pets are just waiting for a loving child to take care of them. I love my dog, Buddy, and I can't imagine living without him. Did you know that there are hundreds of animals in the shelter in the pound waiting for a loving family to take care of them? Taking care of these animals is very expensive, which is why we help the shelter with our community service project. Here's what you can do to help. Bring in any pet supplies or any new unopened pet food. Then bring your food to the media center and you will make all the pets happy. Fifth grade going on a field trip to the Week 3 Expo. Come on, tag along. It'll be so much fun. The Expo features nearly 400 booths, which means spotlighting schools, programs, and careers all around the county. Wow, what kind of schools do have a lot to offer? Whatever you're into, I had a lot of fun at the Week 3 Expo. Well, I collect them and give them to my teacher. At the end of the month, the class that earns the most wins a free Dunkin' Donuts party. Well, all you do is you go home and look at the food products in your pantry and look for this symbol. Once the box is empty, cut the label off like this, just like that. It's easy. Hey owls, it's Mason with Cooking with Mason. Today we'll be making my favorite vanilla French toast. Mm -mm -mm. So we will need two eggs, milk, some cinnamon, vanilla extract, a couple slices of bread, sugar, some non-sticking cooking spray, and for some maple syrup when you need it. Okay, so let's crack some eggs. Next, you will need half a cup of milk. Pour it in. Next, let's add two tablespoons of sugar. Next, we're going to add one tablespoon of vanilla extract. Next, we're going to add a quarter teaspoon of cinnamon. Now let's mix it up. Mmm, that smells so good. Now we're ready to cook. Make sure you have adult supervision. Now, first we just need to spray. Okay, first we need to grab our bread with a fork. Then you want to put it in your mix. Make sure you have both sides because you don't want it just to be to one side. So while you're waiting, make sure you have all your utensils ready, your plate, and your maple syrup. Now it's time to flip it over. Make sure your plate is ready because this thing is almost done. Now, here's my favorite part. Make sure to tune in next time with Cooking with Mason. Bye.